well, old buddy. I never thought I'd ever see you again. You know, I threw this thing away one week ago. My mother, of all people, were treated. I can't understand that. She didn't even want me to play football. I was afraid I was going to get hurt. And here, 12 years later, I find it on my pillow with a note pinned next to it saying, save this for your son. <laughs> Do this instead. Oh, no thanks. I got some uh, store-bought right over here in my own. No, man. This is grass. You, you mean marijuana? Yeah. Lord have mercy. Is that what that is? Let me see that. Go ahead, George, light it up. Oh, no, 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 no. I, I, I couldn't do that. I mean, I've got enough problems with the, with the booze and all. I mean, uh, I can't afford to get hooked. Oh, you won't get hooked. Yeah, uh, well, I know, but I mean, it, it, uh, it leads to harder stuff. say it's all right. Well, uh, all right, then, uh, well, how, how, how do I do it? Here. That's got a real nice uh, taste to it, though. I don't suppose it'll do me much good, though. I mean, I'm so used to the booze and everything. You've got to hold it in your lungs longer, George. What was, what the hell was that, man? Huh? No, man, like, hey, man, wow, I was watching this object, man, like, like the satellite that we saw the other night, right? And, like, it was just going right across the sky, man, and then, I mean, it just suddenly, uh, <laughs> it just changed direction and went, uh, whizzing right off, man. <laughs> it flashed. You're stoned out of your mind, man. Oh, yeah, man, hey, like, I'm stoned, you know, man? But, like, you know, I saw a satellite. And it was going across the sky, and it flashed three times at me and zigzagged and whizzed off, man. And I saw it. <sighs> that was a UFO beaming back at you. Me and Eric Heisman was down in Mexico two weeks ago. We seen 40 of them flying in formation. They, 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 they have got bases all over the world now, you know. They've been coming here ever since 1946, when the scientists first started bouncing radar beams off of the moon. And they have been living and working among us in vast quantities ever since. The government knows all about them. What are you talking, man? Hmm. Well, you just seen one of them, didn't you? Hey, man, I saw something, man, but I didn't see it working here, you know what I mean? They are people just like us from within our own solar system, except that their society is more highly evolved. I mean, they don't have no wars. They got no monetary system. They don't have any leaders because, I mean, each man is a leader. I mean, each man, because of their technology, they are able to feed, clothe, house, and transport themselves equally and with no effort. Well, you know something, man? I think, you wanna know what I think? 
I think this is a crackpot idea. That's what I think. How about that? <laughs> How about a little of that? Think it's a crackpot idea. I mean, if they're so smart, why don't they just reveal themselves to us, huh? And get it over with. <laughs> Why don't they reveal themselves to us is because if they did, it would cause a general panic. Now, I mean, we still have leaders upon whom we rely for the release of this information. These leaders have decided to repress this information because of the tremendous shock that it would cause to our antiquated systems. Now, the result of this has been that the Venusian have contacted people at all walks of life. All walks of life. <laughs> yes. It would be a devastating blow to our antiquated systems. So now the Nutians are meeting with people in all walks of life in an advisory capacity. For once, man will have a godlike control over his own destiny. He will have a chance to transcend and to evolve with some equality for all. How's your joint, George? I believe I believe it went out. I got I got to talking so much I clean forgot about uh, went out. Well, save it. We'll do it tomorrow morning first thing. Right? Gives you a whole new way of looking at the day. <laughs> well, I sure could use that. <laughs> Yes, I sure could use a little of that. <laughs> 